Hey y'all, how's it going? Happy Wednesday. It is a uh, Stranded Alien Dawn Wednesday, and while this probably doesn't matter to most of you, uh, this is actually my Twitch affiliate anniversary. Not that it is going to make any difference uh, in what we're doing today, but for me, it feels kind of like a milestone, and I like that. Anyway, uh, we're here playing Stranded Alien Dawn, if you're unfamiliar with the game. It's Colony Simulator, and I love Colony Simulators. Uh, this one is a little bit unique in that it puts the alien in Alien World. Um, all of these different um, plants and creatures you see have to be kind of investigated to see, is that something we could eat? Does that have something that we could use to do something with? Like, are these guys made of wood, perhaps? Um, are those plants something we can eat? Are those plants poison? Could those plants be used as medication? Lots of possibilities. Uh, for example, there's these folks that we have, uh, we, we've already gone and observed them. It's a peacefulish herbivore uh, called the Draca. Uh, and they are edible and we could actually, um, we could actually tame them. There's two of them right here. And I gotta tell you, I don't like them being right here. This is like where we grow food. And I kind of like it if they would go away. Uh, we're growing energy crystals there. This is um, essentially corn, green cob. What do we got over here? Buttermelon, fantastic. Uh, smoke leaf, which we are using as tea. Uh, silicon leaf, that's skin bark, which we can use for leather. Um, glitter caps, which we can eat. And cloth blossoms, which is essentially cotton. Ember reached physical five. That is not bad at all. Uh, very few of these people started with any skills over like three or four-ish. Look at this guy, he's eating our food. I hate it, well, no, well, he's asleep. He's not eating it, he's asleep. I'd kind of like him to go away. And I don't know a way to just make him go away. So, I'm kind of, I'm kind of at a loss about that. For a battery, our battery is almost at full, which is fantastic. Uh, we're in early spring now. It's about 51 degrees outside, 51 Fahrenheit, I should say. Everyone is kind of crammed into this little barracks that I've built, which isn't ideal, but it's at least indoors. And it's 69 inside, which is pretty nice. It would be a good idea to start trying to get more, uh, we don't really need ore kind of want rock chunks. I want to get uh, more rocks so that we can finish building that uh, this area here where everyone is going to wind up living. And and while I'm here and kind of marking things, oh, we've got a lot of wood being marked here. We, we need a lot of wood to finish up with not only this here, which is going to be the little wall around the place, but we're going to wind up building a wall uh, or a few walls, a series of walls as kind of a, a trap corridor. You know what? Now that I think about it, maybe we just kind of clear out this area just to kind of get it out of the way. Like the blade grass we cut, those bushes cut, cut and cut. Just to get it out of the way because I think this is where the trap corridor is gonna go. I mean, God willing, in the creek don't rise. Speed things up a little bit here. We might have a little, uh, a little adventure we could go on. Let's see, can we, what expeditions do we have? We have just basic exploring, which is okay. A streak of thin smoke coming from this area, which could be a smoke signal. I mean, that could be someone else. Uh, and that's it. It's 
just five hours to get there. I feel like we should do it. Can we, can we do that? I want to engage in that one. Oh, serves sort of like a survivor. My bad. Uh, Ember. Ember is really good at that. Okay, Ember, you're on your way. So in a little bit, the uh, balloon will pop up. And we will see what happens. I wonder if there's more. Does not look like there are any rocks there. We've marked a couple down here. I'll bet there are some over here, but we're starting to get kind of far away from from our house. Let's go ahead and mark that and mine the ore. And when we get back, we really ought to take a look. Yep, the elevator's gone. Hunting Olfen. Did we? I guess we did at some point. Come on, Connor. Make, make it quick and relatively painless-ish. Don't chase him around. Just, you know, get it done. Goodness. I'm kind of thinking maybe those, uh, those pistols that we have aren't all that effective. All right. What were we thinking about? Oh, research. Research is what we were thinking about. Let's check that out. Okay, we are currently researching pulse rifles, which I think are more like stun rifles. And not that that's bad, but I think I would rather have laser pistols, which actually do damage. So, I guess we'll see how it goes. Okay, um, given there are enough cells to power such a monster. All right. Stronger blast waves. Yeah, I think that the laser pistols are the ones that really do damage. Although these laser pipes are pretty awesome. Railgun snipers. We have to get carbon nanotubes for that. How, do, how does one do carbon nanotubes? Let's pause a sec and just zip through here. I haven't seen anything that says, like, nanotubes printing. That is a long, long research. Seven days. Seven days. But, I mean, I kind of get the, I get the feeling that's something that we could use in a lot of different things. So, You can see here, there's these little flying lizards that are coming to, you know, scavenge the dead scarabay we have, which we can cut up and eat, and it's just not working out very well. How's, um, house is coming along. Once it is, once it's complete, we're gonna have to break this down into, I want everybody to have their own room. Oh, expedition complete, didn't smoke. I found a survivor. Yeah, heck yeah, Sora joins plus 18 happiness. Welcome them to our camp. All right, needs another bed. Oh boy. All right, so before we go any further, let's get a bed set up. What do we have resources for? We have, um, I guess, a wooden leather bed is what we could make, or a wooden synther, sin, skin, skin bark. There we go. There's some talking. The wooden skin bark bed. Let's go ahead and light that up. Uh, we want leather. We want leather? I mean, does it matter? What do we have more of? Uh, it's almost a push. Let's do a skin bark because they are purple. And I guess maybe, what, where can we put this? 
Like, will it fit here? Yeah, I guess it will. All right, we need to get that going. Let's see how good uh, Sora is. Good mood, uh, risk of meltdown. That's excellent. Sniper Eye shoots twice as fast with ranged weapons. All right, that's not bad. Vegetarian, but we've already got one of those, so that's okay. We'll be all right accommodating her. Sora grew up inside the caves of a hostile, lawless desert world. She joined the local militia to protect her family from marauders and quickly became known for her sharp eye and quick reflexes. But you can't save everyone. Sora is on the hunt for the person who killed her little sister. All right, that sounds good, Sora. We need to get her weapons. Right now, sadly, I mean, what do we have? We have a short bow and a bunch of spears. I guess she'll get the short bow. I don't think we can make, like, I don't think we can make any weapons yet. Yeah, I'm pretty sure those get made there. I don't think that they get made at our crafting bench. Uh, craft weapons, yeah. Let's see, what's the difference on this here? Does it, does it give me the DPS on it? Okay. Range 49 feet, which is pretty darn good. Uh, hit chance is 60 to 90%. Crit chance is 10 to 15. The short bow has a much greater range. It is a little less accurate. I think the short bow might be, I mean, pound for pound. I think it might be a better weapon. We'll give her the short bow when she gets back. Short bow and a spear. And we've Connor intimidated Samantha. Well, you're kind of a jerk. There's Samantha's doing some practicing. Oh, what, is, what, is, what is this guy doing? That's our food. Although I think that they are herbivores. Sora is unarmed. That won't be for very long. Okay. All right. Well, she's done. Why did you tell me she was unarmed if she's not here yet? I can't do anything about it if she's that far off. We need... I'm trying to remember where I put the... Uh... Okay, I can't find it now. I was trying to remember where I put the little fire where we're cooking stuff. Okay, that's not it. Here it is. Nope, that is the hand pan. That is not it at all. Here we go. Okay. Whew. All right. Uh, let's just add, I mean, four maybe. Drop back two and another five smoke leaf tea. I mean, I'm, I'm not quite sure how we're gonna handle this. Do we have, is there any of this that we can harvest? Nope, not yet. Nothing is ready for harvesting. I mean, Sora, if you wanted to like change your mind on that. All right, Rita is getting some food. Connor, instead of doing that, could you build this bed? That way, Sora would at least have a place to sleep when she gets here. Constructing bed? Where are you going? Oh, he's going to pick up wood. All right, fair enough. Has she touched down yet? Nope, doesn't look like it. All right, can we mark that as uh, Sora's yet? Yes, there we go. That's gonna be Sora's bed. Maybe actually we are at a place where we could check out her abilities and assign her some tasks. First off, uh, okay, healing. A two is not exceptional. I, I think I'm gonna drop her to a four for healing. We'll make this a two, like everyone. 
Her construction is sort of meh. Let's make that a four for now. She is, she's interested in combat and good at it. I think we make this a two. What about this kind of stuff? No, indifferent too. That's not amazing. But she can at least cut stuff down. Let's make that a two for now. And she's not gonna be a rancher and she's not gonna be planting stuff. Scavenging, she would be very good at that. Uh, I think we can make that, let's make that a two for now also. Mining, uh, she could be very good at that also. So we're gonna have to break some of these to threes in a minute. Cooking, okay, she's not a cook. We will make this a four. Uh, crafting, nope, not at all. We'll make that a zero, or not at all. Tailoring, ditto. And assembling, the same. Okay, she's not really a science person. I think we make that, I, I think we leave that at three. Same with uh, research. In fact, let's make research four and uh, observe. Man, I can't talk today. Observation four, there we go. And we'll make hauling two, okay. And maybe, since she has so many blanks, we can give her these twos. All right, welcome Sora. Let's also set up her schedule. I mean, everybody pretty much has the same one. So we'll take Connors, copy that, paste it here. Sora is going to handle the hot air balloon like right away. What a trooper, I like her. All right, we'll have her get the, um, what do you call it? Get the short bow. And then we'll also have her grab a spear. So she's got a melee weapon as well. All right, after that, I, I promise, sorry, you can get something to eat. <laughs> Let's uh, speed up time just a little bit. I would really like to get this done so that, what's, what's Samantha, what are you doing there? Probably, I mean, I don't know that we need like, like jackets right now. Let's wait until it gets a little warmer. What's this? Isn't that something? Samantha, could you uh, maybe, okay, observe that. Observe the poo. I guess. Blocked? Wait, well, a survivor can't go where they want to. Oh no! Uh oh, okay, this is bad. She is trapped in there. And this is really bad. I mean, where am I gonna put that other bed? Rita, what would you think about just getting out of bed on the other side? That's not an option for you? Okay, what if we just do this? Um, can I move the bed? Uh, reconstruct, copy, move. Just move it there. Maybe one of you guys could do that so that she's not, yeah, move the bed so that she isn't trapped. I mean, that would be nice of you. Look, at you see how it was like a little version of it. That was cute. Discovery manure. <laughs> Upon extensive observation of the object, I concluded that it is indeed the byproduct of common metabolism systems metabolic systems known on many worlds as manure however this one seems to be secreting small amounts of flammable liquid that could be collected and used as fuel it could be used as fertilizer as well all right so it unlocks crafting of liquid fuel on a workbench you know what that's all right is it uh 
Yeah, it, it's you know, it doesn't need to be forbidden. Maybe it needs its own little its own little storage spot though. What do you think? I feel like it does. I kind of want manure to be by itself. We'll just make a little stockpile. It can go uh, maybe like back here. And we will, let's see, let's get all of that. Uh, we want to, actually I wanna clear all of the restrictions. If I hit keep empty, will that select all? No, deselect all. There we go, that does it. Uh, is it another item? Nope, it is not. Maybe it's, well, it's certainly not raw food. And it's not that either. Is it a crafting material? It, it most certainly is. Okay. That's what we want to keep there. You know, maybe we keep fuel there also. Samantha is actually working on the carpet. Someone is working on the carpet. Can't reach soft carpet. Oh, because it's, the bed's on top of it. Fair enough. Oh, this is good. This is getting built in. Oh, I'm really glad about that. Although once it is, we're gonna have to break down all of the doors and windows in here and figure out exactly how we're going to handle that. What is all this? Is this just sticks? Raw smoke leaf. You know what? All of this should be, do I have to mark it to be picked up? Uh, yeah. No, I do want people to be able to use it. Okay. Insufficient storage space for 47 wood. Okay. I thought we had quite a bit of storage space, but I guess we did not. I, I do sort of wish they could just take the wood that's there and just take it directly over here to build stuff. I mean, it just take it from the source to the destination. Cut out the middleman. But I guess it doesn't work like that. So, uh, let's do, we want storage. We'll just do stockpile. I guess right there. Maybe we just make both of them. Deselect construction materials. Can I get a look at all of them? And let's just make it wood. I mean, for the time being. Actually, maybe stone also. Let's just see how that works. Oh, it's for toxic ash once more. That's not great. That's not great at all. Okay. So now it's just insufficient materials. Is this sticks? Oh, that was sticks. It wasn't, it wasn't wood at all. My bad. Okay, let's add sticks to this. Sora got hurt? What happened? Sora, what, what happened there? I wonder if it has something to do with the toxic ash. Are you okay? Brain euphoria, temperature 98.6. I don't know why she took damage. I think it's Samantha who is also a vegetarian. Yeah, okay. So Samantha and Sora are both vegetarians. Maybe I should, let's see here. 
quick meals. I mean, can I copy this? Yeah, I'll copy her restrictions and I'll paste them here. There we go. Although, I mean, maybe, maybe they're gonna have to start eating. Um, maybe they're gonna have to start eating that stuff. Uh, let's salvage that. We're gonna have to start eating the emergency rations. All right, Ember is carrying around a whole bunch of wood. Awesome, that's fantastic. So she did take it from source to destination. I hear some thunder. Makes me think there's a storm coming up. Shortness of breath, moderate pain. There's a lot of that going on. Okay, what's the temperature like in here? 70 indoors. That's pretty comfortable. Maybe we can get rid of one of these, um, one of these heaters. Let's see, can I deconstruct it? I sure can. Where's Sora? Okay, no, Sora is asleep. Rita is not asleep. What's Rita doing? Rita, what are you up to? She's transporting stone. She's busy working. I mean, I admire that, Rita. I really do, but you could go ahead and go to bed if you want to. It's 2 a.m. Now you want to eat. Rita, it's going to be like 4.30 by the time you get to sleep. Uh, no, it's going to be 5 a.m. by the time she gets to sleep. What's Samantha doing? She just standing there? How's our, I mean, how are our plants growing? How is that coming along? Doesn't seem like it's coming along very well. I mean, it says it's growing. Minus 10% because of the ash. How about uh, the buttermelons? Harvestable yield, zero. That's, that's not a great figure. You like to see a positive figure and not zero. Okay, what about over here? Zero of 225. All right, so essentially, the, the takeaway point there is that nothing is ready. And everybody is taking damage from the skin bark. What do we have here? Oh, fruit bush. These are blueberries, essentially. What, what was this again? This is buttermelons? Maybe I expand this field. Uh, yeah, that's enough. I know my fields look a little weird, but... Well, they do. And maybe we expand this one also. There we go. Oh, research pulse rifles. Very nice. Let's see if we can't whip some up. Okay, uh, craft weapons. Look at that. Let's make some pulse rifles. Uh, let's make two. Requires skill crafting four. We've got somebody who's got that, right? Uh, probably not. Okay, yeah, Nura's crafting six. Annette has crafting four. I think that's probably about it. But still, that's a couple. That's a couple people who can handle it. I wonder if I should maybe put another, uh, another lightning roll, a uh, lightning rod. What do they call lightning rod? Yeah, a lightning rod down here. 
honestly, I mean, there's a case to be made for two lightning rods, if not three. Like one here. One over here. And then I think a th yeah, a third. Like over in this area. Okay. All right, Connor is going to get salvaging done, which is great. I would really like to get some more stuff out of there. I scavenged nine electronics, I think. I think that's electronics. Either way, it's something awesome. Uh, it is, yeah, electronics. Can't reach soft carpet. L then don't worry about it. It's okay. It's much more important to finish this up. Now they're gonna go put lightning rods together. That's okay too. So my thinking is that we'll have like, let's pause a second. We will leave this gate open and we'll put like a wall here and then a line of the walls that goes here and uh, then from here like that, and then down here, and then like that. So they'll have to go enter, walk through here, walk through here, walk through here. And we will line these with traps. We'll put a couple more towers here for our guys to be able to shoot. And we will uh, put some turrets in, in those areas as well. I mean, that's the plan. Connor is ill. What's up, buddy? Blood poisoning. The good news is we have some antibiotics. It, you know what? It might not be a bad idea for you to go wait for treatment. Nope, I don't want to forbid him from it. I want him to go and do that. And then, like, if somebody would go and do that whole treatment thing, that would be pretty awesome. Now we have two people. This is not great. This toxic ash thing sucks. I do not care for it. All right, who are our, uh, who are our doctors again? We need to get them off their ass. They need to be getting some doctoring done. So that's uh, Naras and Ember. Naras, what are you doing right now? You're asleep. Ember, also asleep. You know, Naras is going to sleep. He's not asleep. I want you to heal Connor Drace. No, he's not. He's going to sleep. Oh, okay, good. He, he woke up. He woke up to take care of it. Or did someone else do it? I mean, maybe someone else did. Either way, it got taken care of. Creature comforts. Is that from the bed? Oh, that must be the bed and the uh, carpet. Minor pain relief from the tea. Very nice. I didn't know the tea did that. That's great. <laughs> Favorites, buttermelon pie and target practice. <laughs> I like it. Ember is all right with me. Who else do we have that's sick now? Sora is sick. And Naras is taking care of her. All right, Naras, thank you. How's she doing now? Better? Uh, in perfect physical shape. Outstanding. You know, we should break down this. I mean, maybe break down it. How? It's 59 Fahrenheit indoors. Maybe we leave that second one up. 59 Fahrenheit is still a bit chilly. Rita, what's wrong? Let's, let's see what's wrong with Rita here. Ravenously hungry and tired. Well, you're asleep now, so that's going to take care of that. And then once you get up, you can go take care of that one. So I'm not worried. I'm not worried about that. I think we're going to be okay. I 
I wonder if I could housing and put a door like here. And then like stairs from the door. Can I do that? Uh, oh, we have to pick a material for them. I, I guess would. Let's wait for that door to get put in and then we'll put stairs in. Okay. Samantha just sort of likes to just sit around every so often. I've noticed. All right, Rita, are you getting some food? She is. And with that, she is okay. Hey, has anybody started making uh, pulse rifles yet? We have any pulse rifles being made? Oh no, they're they're way down here. Let's uh, let's bring them up onto the top. Okay, not enough resources. What are we missing? Pause a sec. Ten metal alloys and two power cells. So maybe we need to make power cells or somehow get them because it looks like we don't have. We have one. All right. Can we make power cells? I think that we can, but I think we need, yeah, we need energy crystals for it. So until the energy crystals that we are growing are uh, done, and that's not going to happen anytime soon, or so it would seem, I guess we, uh, I guess we wait. So we don't get to have the fancy pulse rifles. What are we researching now anyway? Let's let's have a look at that. Laser pistols. I think that is a great thing to be researching now. What do railgun snipers need? Oh, that's right. Carbon carbon nanotubes. Forgot about that. Okay, that is Once we get some grain, we could actually start pressing fuel out of that, which would be really good. What's the advanced research desk do for us? Oh, uh, with great CPU power comes great responsibility. All right. Uh, okay. We'd be able to research stuff quicker. All right. Let's keep that like on the, uh, uh, on the mind. Is Rita over here playing the didgeridoo? Or did she just go over here and now she's coming back and she is going to be? It looked like she was going to do like a little Pied Piper thing. She was gonna go out to all the weirdo animals out there and play her didgeridoo. All right, this guy right here might need to become food. Are there any more of them kicking around? All right, I hate to do this because he seems like he's probably a nice guy, but you can't eat our food. And I know that's what you want to do. Unless you leave right away, I'm going to leave this on. If you leave, I'll take it off hunting. Otherwise, I'm fairly certain as soon as somebody. Yeah, there we go. Sora is Sora got her bow out. All right. I don't think we need to hunt him anymore. We chased him off. Are you kidding me? We did not chase him off. All right. We're going to have to kill him. He's uh, dying. He's losing health. So he is bleeding. That's interesting. Uh, yeah, arrow wound. He's bleeding, so he's losing damage or losing health from the arrow wounds. That is kind of a rough way to go. All right. Well, that sounds really scary. Did like, did that 
did the whole Draka nation decide it was time to attack? What's going on here? Well, nobody's, uh, nobody's health is... Uh, this, that music is far too dramatic. It was far too scary. But I guess we'll have, you know, Draka to eat. That won't be bad. Yes, you are allowed to carry that item. Okay, good. I mean, will they pick that up on their own or do I need to tell them, go and pick up that stuff? It kind of seems like they won't. Oh, you can even hear her. I don't know if you guys could hear it, but I, I could hear Rita playing it just then. That's funny. How is this doing now? My blueberries are coming along. They're, they're, they're not in a hurry, but they are coming along. We need to get this done. Is it... It's not that we're lacking steady, it's just we're lacking people that will build. Let's take a look at construction here. And we have three people that have construction at two right near the top. Uh, Samantha also has observe and research on at one. Maybe we don't need to have one for that. Maybe that could be a two. And let's see, what about our other construction people? All right, Connor has hunt at one and cook at one, and that I'm okay with. Ember has cut at one, which I don't think we need anymore. We can put that at two, and maybe that's gonna speed up construction a bit. Did she hit Ember? I just saw it, it looked like Ember took damage there. Guess not. All right. We should take a look. It still says old equipment there. So I suppose we should have a look at everybody's equipment, see if anybody is in really bad shape. Uh, Ember needs a new spear. So Ember, get yourself a new spear. Neuras, you're mostly okay for now. All right, Rita needs a new spear also. You get yourself a new spear. Annette doesn't have a spear. We, we may as well give her one. Get yourself a spear, Annette. You know, Samantha doesn't have one either. She also doesn't have a hat. Put a hat on. And also get a spear. And she's okay, but she does not have a hat. Get a hat. All right. It's coming back. Oh no, it, it, it heard what happened. And it was like, forget it, okay, it's cool. I won't come in there and eat your food. I heard what happened to Jim. Oh, I'm really really looking forward to having laser pistols to being able to build them okay disturb sleep yeah someone made noise and woke me up boy I feel you there I feel you there
So maybe, I mean, do we, do we start the, do we start building it now? Let's see if it'll let me. Let's see if it'll let me do that. Uh, so we want, um, or, oh, it's just a thunderstorm. Man, that really startled me. Uh, okay, defense, fortification, uh, wooden. So like, let's have that go. Like that. And then I think, no, that's all. And then we take uh, defense, fortification, wooden wall, and maybe go to like here. Am I doing that or no, I'm not, okay. So, hold on, let's... Because I want there to be like a space they can walk through here. So, cancel that. Cancel that. And cancel that. And then, uh, defense. Fortification, wooden. All right, we'll look into that in a minute. Okay, let's see how that goes. And I think we can cancel some of this stuff here. And I suppose we should build another tower or two. Okay. All right, so, oops, there's like a little hole here. That won't do at all. I'm hoping that people aren't getting hit by lightning and such while I'm, you know, fussing around with this. Uh, okay. I can't build one there, can I? The underlying terrain is too rough. Well... A large burning object, most definitely a chunk of a spaceship, crashed in the distance. There was something peculiar about its shape. Intriguing! We'll maybe go check that in a minute. Okay, uh, defense. Okay, I mean, that's not great. But it was a way I could do it. I think also, let's pause a second here. Did I pause? I did. Let's wipe out some of this. Uh, cancel that. Cancel that. And then we will build a... Uh, I think a fence? I think a fence would be low enough. Uh, it looks like a pole fence. And just put it like right here. And what we'll do, uh, we'll also put in defense of, I guess a fence gate. Is that the right thing? Uh, a pole one. Nope, not that. Okay, I want one that's like much smaller. Isn't there like a little small gate? Fence door. We'll do sticks, that's fine. Yeah, there we go. We'll just put that there. And that way, 
there will be a way for people to go in here to mess with the mess with the turrets that I'm gonna want to put in. Destroyed the shooting target. And well done. Nice job. I don't think anybody got hit by lightning. I don't see any damage, so yay. I'm pleased. It doesn't look like any of our crops took damage. Also, fantastic news. The grain cob is growing fairly well. I guess it's not really time to harvest it, but still, that's good. Everybody going to sleep. What about this stuff? I wish that it would give me like a, you know, like ETA of when I'm going to be able to harvest it. Like going medieval does that. I really like that. Like it'll say you'll be able to harvest it in three days, four hours. Okay, average health 90%. That's not awesome. Some of the soil is kind of not very good. I wonder if I could, har um, not harvest it, uh, fertilize it. Allow survivors to fertilize the plants on this field. That sounds like a pretty darn good idea. All right, hold the phones. We got bad guys coming in. Man hunting glutch. We ran into the, normally these glutch things are like totally chill. Not this time. This time they're not at all totally chill. Okay. I know that Sora and Connor are both absolute crack shots. I think we're gonna let Sora, um, let's, let's draft everyone first. Well, everyone except Neuros who won't fight because I don't know. And we'll have everybody muster right there. Are these guys, are these coming down like right now? Oh, it just says they're exhibiting hostile. Okay, it's not yet time for that. Oh, well, we may as well get ready. Let's get somebody who can really shoot well, like Sora, and put her up here kind of wish some of these other towers had been built, but what are you going to do? They're coming. Yikes. All right. I was wrong. Let's get uh, the rest of these people. Kind of move them back a little. I mean, the good news is we will have kind of a little a little spot to shoot at them as they come through. They will all have to come through right. Never mind. I forgot. That's not done at all. Okay. Uh, you guys, let's back up a bit just to give Sora. Okay. That's, that's what I wanted. I want Sora to be able to get involved. Connor there. Ember there. And who are you? And, no, Ember there. Oh, who's that? Oh, Samantha there. Okay. All right. Where's Neuros? Oh, he's over there eating. It seems to be going fairly well. All right, come on, everybody, hit your shots. Three left, that's two. Very good, and uno mas, our team wins. All right, hey, really a good performance, everyone. No injuries, everyone is fine. Let's, uh, let's wait a minute for this little, like, green stuff to kind of go away. And now let's butcher the heck out of those. Uh, Manhunting Glitches, butcher. Hey, that went pretty darn well. I, I am really pleased at that. And that was after me making the really dorky mistake of thinking that this was all done when it is most certainly not.
I wonder if we can make have we have we researched being able to make uh we can veggie leather heck yeah like until we have I don't know 30 of it that sounds pretty good so is it 10 of it makes one because if 10 of it makes one maybe we just make 10 and we'll go from there or if 10 of it makes 10 I don't know let's see what happens like it says it's gonna need 10 to make 10 I think You know what? Let's make 30. Joked with Connor about weightlifting. Who is that? Was that Sora? Sora just asked Connor, do you even lift, bro? I love it. Sora might become one of my favorite colonists. I, I appreciate that Sora is a vegetarian. She doesn't mind getting her hands dirty. Look at all of the corn. Oh, I think they're harvesting it. They are. Oh, we're going to have so much. We might need another. I mean, I hadn't thought about this. We might need another refrigerator. We absolutely are going to need another refrigerator. I guess we put it over here. Uh, we need somebody to build it like pronto. What is, what are you doing, Samantha? Are you interested in construction? What are you, what are you currently constructing? Because I tell you, we could use someone who's constructing something to construct a refrigerator. And just chill, Ember, okay? She got to construction too and built the refrigerator. Fantastic. Let's go here and I want to copy the restrictions and I want to paste them in here. So quick meals can go in there. Uh, not emergency rations and then all the raw foods. All right, real good. How are we doing on, uh, on power? I think if we check the battery, it'll tell us. New resource, veggie leather. Rita reached farming eight. Eight. So we're producing 76 and consuming 35. That's pretty darn good. That is pretty darn good. Where are these? I really want to like, could I fertilize these? Yeah, it fertilized the energy crystals too. That would be great. All right, look, this guy might have to get hunted. And I, I hate hunting these guys. I think the Draka are really cool, but we can't have you eat here in here eating our veg. Ah, excuse me, I had to hydrate a little bit. We could try to tame it. I think we have some grain, don't we? Uh, that's just quick meals. 330 grain. Who do we have that is any good at all at this? Uh, I think it's here. Nope, I was wrong. Here we go. Uh, okay. Farming, zero. It is not Connor. Zero, not Ember. No? Rita could do it. Um, Annette might be able to. Not Samantha. Not Sora. Honestly, Rita would be the one. I mean, do we try? Why not? Rita? Lovely Rita meter maid? Let's give this a shot. How 
how neat would it be to have one of these on our team? I would love that. I mean, I know she's busy doing what she's doing right now, and that's fine, but once she's ready, that's gonna be fantastic. I think this is on laser pistols? Yeah. That'll be exciting. I would love to be able to make laser pistols. Can I, hold on, let's pause for a sec. I wanna make sure that I have either researched or can research turrets. Okay. So far, I'm not seeing them. They'd be on, de on defense, right? I would assume so. Uh, improved pulse rifles, improved laser pistols. I mean, I would expect turrets to be there, right? Unless we've already done them. Let's have a look. Defense, automated turret. Okay, automated defense station shoots at all targets in its range. I wonder how that works. Yeah, so that's gonna require fuel and I don't really have them. This uses energy, I think, and energy I can make. Just as an experiment, let's go put, that uses 40, that uses 30, and that uses 50. Let's put a, a missile launcher? How much fun would a missile launcher be? Yeah, the machine gun is the one that's kind of in the middle. We'll make it. We'll make it that. Oops, wrong side. Oh, can I can I get it to fit in there? Obstructed access to another device. Okay, I could put it there. I wonder if it can fire over this. I'm not sure it can. All right, let's, you know what? Let's not put that in right now. Let's cancel that and go see, let's go see what's up with Ember. Ember, what's wrong? Why are you upset? It's dark, unrelaxed and drowsy. Okay, it is dark. You're right. There is more light over here. Like there's this big splash or floodlight thing. And there's a fire and there's like a torch. Uh, or you could go inside where it's all lit up. So it's a bit of a you problem. I wonder if any of these are ready to be harvested. Uh, they sure are. Harvest. And harvest those too. That's really good. What's Rita doing? What, I want to take a look at where we have that set up for her. I mean, is she ever gonna get around to it? Pause a second. That ranch is a one. So once she's done harvesting, she should go right to it. I guess she is, well, I mean, it's, it's relaxation time. So it's fine for her to be doing that. That's totally okay. All right, 
Everybody's turning in. And the Draka that we were potentially going to tame is over there. There's another one over here. Ugh. I mean, do we tame this one too? Kind of don't want to have, I, I would like to just have one for now. Drops useful waste once per day. That's not bad. All right, well, we're gonna let the night go on. What's it like inside? What's the temperature like? 65, that's comfortable. Wait, these guys really want private rooms. You know what, guys? Private rooms can happen. You just have to finish building this. As soon as that's done, bam, private rooms. That will happen next. I will make it so. If you're watching this on YouTube and you, you've maybe messed with this before, will this fence, the pole fence here, will a, a turret be able to fire from behind that? Like if I put, you know, say four turrets here, will they be able to turn fire down here and then turn fire? Uh oh, that's probably you're right here. You don't seem blocked. Uh, you seem just fine. Oh, it's because of the carpet. Is that what you're upset about? All right, getting all this done. Well, the, the very second I said that, they stopped. I think some of the, uh, let me take a look at that, but I think, yeah, veggie leather. We've got some. I mean, I saw there's like, I think there's like a veggie leather armor you can make. Although to be honest, that's gonna be three days. That's gonna be half a day. That's gonna be a day, that's gonna be a week. Oh, solar eclipse, botherations. Uh, all right, so. Maybe we get rid of that. Let's do antibiotics production. And then we'll do uh where is it where was the the super fancy um research desk i just thought that might be a good one to put in here we go advanced research desk and maybe we build another uh another wind turbine That way, on days when, you know, the, when we're not making energy from our, uh, or as much energy as we would like uh, from our solar panels, we can still be getting it from wind. a lot of people constructing fortification. That's not bad. I think the disabled devices are the solar panels. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. It, yeah. Carry on. to make sure that Connor still has cooking at number one. I want to make sure he is preparing food. Uh, Connor has hunt one and scavenge one. Nope. We make that a two and then we make cook one. That could have been really bad. 
Everybody's already eating emergency rations. Well, we've got seven meat soup in there, 11 cups of tea. That's good. Can we get rid of that other heater yet? No. Yeah, I think those are going to have to stick around for a while. I don't know what the uh, the summer is going to be like. I don't know how hot it gets. Oh, they've started building this already. That's awesome. Rotted away. What is that that is rotted away? I think that that's manure, which is, I guess, all right. I'm not going to be upset about that. Liked Connor's opinion on bladed weapons. Okay. Yikes. I do kind of wish there was a way I could, during thunderstorms, make them stay inside. Oh, Samantha reached construction three. That's great. What is she building? Connor is a risk of meltdown. What's up, buddy? Disturbed sleep. Scope wet. Was annoyed by Samantha. Well. What do we have? 1090 grain. Uh, lots of red meat, plenty of insect meat. I've, I've well over a thousand buttermelons. I wonder if we shouldn't think about pickling some. Uh, let's pickle like, let's see, amount for one meal is 10. We could pickle the buttermilk. We could pickle really anything that we grow. Let's do 50 just to see what happens. So it looks like you need 100 for it to make 50. I'm really reluctant to like make a whole bunch when I don't know if it's going to be a one for one, am I going to wind up with a million of those things? We're going to be eating pickled squash for months to come. Cool. Connor is cooking. That's great. Hey, we finished all this. Hold on. Oh, okay. That's the little thing there. Finished all these towers. That's really good. Insufficient storage space for all. Yeah. I'm not surprised. Look at all the food in there. Now we need another, we need another refrigerator. Can I build a copy? I can. Okay, good. I mean, should I start moving them over here? Oh, that's where the door is. Um, that's not really where the food is, though, is it? Maybe we do it there. Is that going to be all right? I think so. Oh, awesome. We have laser pistols researched. Can we build them now? 
Where's that soldering bench? Can we? Let's let's wipe uh, those for the time being. Craft laser pistols. Let's make three of them. Can we can we do that? Awaiting materials. Yes. Get that to the top. I want laser pistols. Taming taming failed. You can try again after the cooldown. Well, who was it? Oh, hold on. Let's. Who was it? It was Rita. Was it Rita? That should have been an automatic. Let's see. Required skill is farming five. Oh, I guess there's not an automatic. 20% retaliation chance on fail. Yikes. All right. Well, I guess we should just be thankful that it didn't retaliate. Is she chasing it around playing the handpan now? Oh no, oh, she's not. She's going to play it. Fair enough. All right, research. We are 18% on the, well, the insect fat press, which is not great. Rita, can you build things? What's your construction like? It is zero. All right. I think Samantha can build things. Heck yeah, she can. All right, finish eating up, Samantha, and then I'd like you to build a refrigerator. No, you were going to go to sleep, but instead, wouldn't you prefer to build a refrigerator? How about that, huh? Yeah, there you go. Way to go. Oh, it's unpowered. We will have to get uh, a power pole out there. Let's see. What do we got more of? We have more wood. So let's move. I think if I put it out here. Yeah, I see a little line that's going out to it. So we will just slap it right there. Well, I'll have to wait for somebody to wake up and do that. But that's all right. Look at that little jerk. He was just eating some of our food. I don't know. Maybe we just hunt him. Maybe we've had enough of him, enough of his foolishness. All right, pal, I'm just going to give you some, you know, words of wisdom. Don't be anywhere near this area in a few hours because we're going to start shooting. I got people awake and that's not somebody who's gonna go shoot at them I don't think no Connor would if he didn't have to heat or, I know we don't have the storage space thank you very much actually maybe Connor could just build this real quick because once we do that that uh there we go this is powered right are you powered you are Let's, let's pause a second. I want to uh, copy the restrictions, go over to this one, paste them on. Oh, it was retaliating. A Con a Connor is victorious. And now he's going to chop it up and eat it. That is what you get when you try to eat our blueberries. We shoot you in the face and eat you. All right, this one right here is, is he eating the little pink things? What? He's like so little though. He's just little. Or she is just little, pardon me. You know what, let's, let's just try. Let's try another, we'll do another taming run and see if it works.
All right. A lot of construction on this building going on, which is really good. Ember's got construction at five. Real good. What is this? Oh, that's stone. All right. So I guess we need... I guess we need to actually have storage space for stone. Could we put stone in this? Construction materials. Yes, but I guess it's full. Which is a little frustrating, to be honest. Okay, storage. Just do a stockpile. And then we will make all three of these. I think we're gonna do the same thing. We'll just copy uh, what we have here. Copy restrictions and paste them in. Might not be a bad idea to go and see about how everyone's clothes are doing. It still says old equipment to me. I mean, some of his aren't great. His jacket isn't. And his, I mean, they're mediocre, but they're adequate. Same. Uh, same, okay. I'm starting to see a pattern here. All right, is this the tailoring bench? It is. Let's not make any more thermal pants. Let's make five shirts. Let's make five baseball caps. Let's make uh, I, probably summer pants, right? We'll make six of them. And then uh, we should probably make, I don't know, I feel like sneakers is probably a better choice than just summer shoes. So we'll do sneakers. And we'll do six. All right. That is making me think that we are actually going to need more of that veggie leather I was talking about. Let's put another 30 in and just see how this goes. What, what's all the, okay, just practicing. That's fine. You know, as you were, Connor, destroyed the target. Well, that's what you get. Spaceship debris crash. A large burning object, most definitely a chunk of a spaceship was seen crashing in the distance. If left as it is, anything salvageable will perish in the following days. Okay. All right. So, what kind of expeditions do we have? Just have generic exploration. We have a peculiar crash site. It is a long travel time. Look at the travel time on that. Ten hours. But this is a limited time one. I think we do this one. And let's send Ember, because we usually do. All right, Ember, good luck. Hey, look at that. All of the fortifications are up. I just, I don't know if the, look at the size of this guy. I don't know if one of those turrets will fit there. That really un it, it, it really kind of worries me. How's our battery doing? Is it still It's still staying at a thousand. What's that? Oh, Maybe we need to have them make more meat soup or meat stew or whatever it is. Because we don't really have them making very many. 
Let's go ahead and put four more on there. Okay, you can now order survivors to lead the animal to a selected location. Depending on the animal, there are options to allow the survivors to train or play with it. Do I need to build him a pen? Look at that. Look at that fella, rename. Uh, I think we will name him. Let's see, we're doing dwarves in, uh, in Going Medieval. So I think we do hobbits here. There we go. I think that that might have been a female that I just named Bilbo, but, uh, eh, what are you going to do? Okay, so, like, what can we do with this now? Uh, lead the animal to another location. You slaughter the animal or heal it. Okay, it can't be trained. So, basically, we just have it. It poops for us, and then we use it to fertilize. That's... I mean, I suppose that's okay. That's not ideal. I, I was kind of hoping for a different outcome, I'll be honest. It's like, get yeah, these trees. I, I don't want them to be able to hide in those trees. You know what, let's put a couple of those down. And if they work, awesome and if they don't work we'll know that they won't work uh machine guns we'll do one there and uh where is it defense automated turret machine guns we'll do one here insufficient materials okay so where is that? Here we go. We need to be making... I, maybe we put this up to 100. Annette cheered up Samantha. That's nice. Oh, hey, is this done too? Okay, what, what does this do? Hides the front walls. Okay, no, that's what I wanted. But I kind of wanted to see that so that I can put the door in. Uh, housing? Door. We'll do just a metal door, I think. Yeah, perfect. Right there. Okay. I think starting tomorrow morning, we break down the walls in here and we start trying to set this up into some semblance of rooms. Insulted Rita's sense of humor. God, Connor, don't be a jerk. Expedition complete, let's check this out. I found crates bearing the name of the spaceship that I was on. Most were badly damaged, but I salvaged some emergency rations. That's not awful. Okay, return to base. You can meet Bilbo. Okay, so let's... How big is this? Like, uh, one, two, three, four, five... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven... 12. All right, so there's 12 here. How how far across are we here? One, two, three, pause. Four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, so if we do like... Let's, we're paused for a second here. Um, first off, let's break down these uh these walls 
just the stick wall, please. I don't know why it is picking everything there, but it really wants to deconstruct the whole room. No, just deconstruct this little wall, please. Okay. So, all right, I think we're gonna have to have like, maybe we have a, a corridor kind of going this way and a corridor kind of going this way. And then we have rooms on either side. Hey, uh, Annette, Connor, if you wanted to start coming, breaking some of these down, that would be awesome. Or any of you, really. Or you could just kind of sit there a while. That's fine, too. Applauded Samantha. Well, she said something nice about Samantha. Lost Harvest? Why? But why? Did, did that creature eat them? Naras visiting Bilbo. Does he get like a... I want to see if he gets like a little mood buff from that. And he like hangs out with him. Okay, hold on. Watched an animal plus 10. How neat! How neat is that? Ah, uh, that's really cool. I like that. Annette has cooking at five. That's great. Did these get done? I think that they did. Samantha is going to build the stairs. Who's around? Connor is cooking. I think Ember is still on her trip. Naras, what are you doing right now? You're carrying stuff. Rita is harvesting. She's setting that up. Samantha is... Okay, Sora maybe. I, I need somebody to like... Maybe we'll get Samantha. Like, Samantha, could you come and... I Maybe... I, did I not tell them to... Now it says reconstruct. I want deconstruct. There we go. All right, so do I have Samantha selected? I do not. Deconstruct sticks wall. Chop, chop, excellent, very well done. All right, so. One, two, three. I'm gonna need to measure the whole darn thing. I wonder if there's an easy way to do this. Have it paused. What if I was like putting something down? Let's say like a punching pole. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. All right. Twelve long. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight wide. Eight wide. So we need to have. Uh, let's set up walls here and I'm, I'm okay making like our interior walls can be stick walls because we've got sticks for days so we'll go um, like a stick wall going down here and then another one. Oh wait there we go okay good All right, come on, stick walls. Are we not doing stick walls anymore? Housing, walls, stick walls. Here we go, all the way. And then, housing, uh, walls, stick walls, like, to there. To there. And 
and then I guess kind of the same across the way. Oh, TSG! Uh, gracias! Thank you very much. I appreciate that. We're gonna throw more stick walls in here one way or another actually you know what let's not do this one right here cancel that one there we go okay walls I am doing real well, thank you very much. I appreciate you stopping by. Have you ever played Stranded before? Uh, it is it is kind of a new game for me. I'm sort of stumbling along in it, but I really like it a lot. What about yourself? How are you? Just grab here and go. Yeah, that's perfect. All right. Okay, maybe I don't. Maybe I don't do the ones in here yet until I can start moving some of the beds. So maybe like each, can I make each room like three? Like uh, if I went, you know, space, bed, space, and then had a wall. Would that be enough? Let's, let's, let's make a test room and see how it goes. Bought it July 30th, it's, it's a plate 130 hours in eight days. Wow, that is a lot. That is a lot. We will just throw a, uh, a wooden door here. Let's see how that goes. I have a feeling it's not gonna give us enough room, but we're gonna see how it goes. Yeah, I will take any tip you've got. on foot. I guess I need another table. I don't really have enough room for everyone now. Into a, uh, a stick shelter. That is not how I wanted it to be. During summer, you must tailor straw hats and summer clothes to face extreme heat waves. Otherwise, the team will be getting heat stroke and die because of the heat. Okay. I had been doing uh, baseball caps, but I am happy to uh, make a change if that's going to be more helpful.
Maybe we put that on uh, our tailoring bench right now. We will scratch making baseball caps here. And we will add in. Uh, we want to sew hats. Draw hats. We'll make a half dozen of them. The good news is we have hay for days, so. Okay. And then before winter, you must tailor winter clothes. Extreme cold snaps will cause hypothermia and possibly kill your team. Okay. Do you recommend starting to work on winter clothes like in the fall? Or do you, do you usually wait until winter's actually hit? I know in going medieval, you've got to stay way ahead of the game. And my blueberries come in here. Well, slowly. Yeah, it's wise to tailor before winter because it takes some time to make clothes for a large community. All right. Okay. We'll keep that in mind. Uh, also, get another power pole up here. think that's enough and I can make traps already awesome Unpowered device. Oh, it's because those haven't been done yet. That's fine. Where are... There we go, traps. Okay, to start... Press, okay, here we go, hold shift, that'll do it. All right, that's what I wanted. Whoa, I don't want to build like a whole bunch of them. There we go, that, that'll do. another question for you i've set up some machine gun turrets and i've got them behind uh these these little pole fences here will the machine gun turrets be able to fire over that i've been worried that they might not be able to of wood or bricks and wind turbines and solar panels and you can have air conditioners and heaters inside the home which is very useful okay my base right now is stone um 
I do have a lot of wind turbines and solar panels. I think I have, I think I have two of each right now. I don't have air conditioners up yet though. I'm still kind of trying to get my, my base sorted. Usually put the turrets on an elevated structure. Okay. Uh, all right. I like that idea. Let me get to my turrets here. How can I do that? Is there like a little platform? Oh, you a floor. I got you. Okay. All right. So I could just put like a floor. Here, let's do this. Let's cancel the construction on that. Oh, how about that? You know what? Let's uh, let's turn that one off. I don't think it's. I think they said it's not connected to a power source anyway. All right. Go we'll wait for these folks. What do we got? Five man hunting glitch, 18 scarabay, and six explosive ones. All right, that's okay. No, I, 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 I understand what you mean right now about by putting a floor under it, and that makes total sense. That makes a lot of sense. All right, so I'll have three towers set up. I think I've got good shooters I can put on there. We'll wait for them to decide they want to attack. I'll let everybody sleep until then. All right, you aggressive animals. We going to do this or not? There we go. All right, battle stations, everybody. Let's go muster over here real quick. Except... Uh, well, I mean, Naras, you just go over here. You maybe stay inside and be safe. Just get ready to come heal people as needs be. Where are these guys coming from? So they are coming from there. We don't have this gate closed. Mm. Oh, that's my bad. Could Naras get there in time? Okay, Naras, hurry. Get there fast. Run faster, buddy. Run faster. Okay, now just run away. <laughs> run back over to where everyone else is. Uh, and let's put, like, Connor up here, and Sora up here, and Ember up here. Uh-oh, run, Naras, run! Uh-oh, Naras is in a lot of trouble. Oh, what a hero he will die if he, if he does. Maybe I send, like, uh, Annette to go save him. Uh, Annette, can you take your crossbow and see about going to help him out? Maybe we take Samantha to do that, too. Okay, I think that that's one that's, that's dead. Okay. Naras seems like he's okay now. Bleeding, not life threatening. Just go there. You too. Maybe come back here. 
There's still one in the base. Up oh, two in the base. Sorry. Come on, you guys, hit your shots. All right, there we go. Now let's just go and uh, we'll grab Samantha and just go kind of around here. Let's see, who am I missing? Annette. Now none of the turrets uh, are, or my turret isn't powered. And none of my traps are in, but the guys in my tower seem like they're doing all right. They seem like they're getting the job done. You get the best boost of happiness by making bedrooms with five by four squares. This will give a happiness of plus eight, ooh, a bonus of 18 when they sleep. That's a, that's an awfully big bonus. All right. I might need to go ahead and, and completely revamp those. I'm gonna have to build a lot more. How many more do we have? Just two more. Two more of these little jerks. That it? Did we win? We won! All right. And what a hero Neuros is. Undraft. All right, undraft and go and rest. And uh, let's... Man, time to butcher those and butcher those guys and those. All right, I gotta see how bad Naras is. How are you doing, buddy? Uh, okay, left foot, superficial times three. Right foot superficial times two and bitten off flesh. Yuck. Left leg superficial, bitten off flesh times two. He did get chomped on a good bit. He got chomped on a good bit. You have to put ceramics on the floor. Will carpet work? I had been putting carpet on. Will that work instead of ceramics? So you said five by four. All right, so let's do this. Let's let's deconstruct this for now. Let's deconstruct this wall for now, or at least order it to not be constructed. And then let's go housing room and. Let's see. Okay, you were saying wood or brick, so let's go with wood this time. We'll go with wood from here. Overlapping foundations. That must be because this hasn't been de de or destroyed yet. At least I'm, I'm assuming that's it. She is cooking. You know, Connor's not doing anything. Connor, come and deconstruct these. All right, so let's see if this works now. Can I just tell it? Do rooms. go okay i needed to be able to see everything i could my mouse was not cooperating with me uh you know what i could probably pull this down it's got a blocking object and it's not gonna it's not gonna play well with me until i do something with it so let's move it let's move that just a little further down
Okay, uh, damaged wooden fortification. Where's that? Boy, there's a lot of dead ones there. Oh, that's right. Okay, and I was gonna try uh, your idea. I was gonna put uh, flooring. Let's just do like a scrap metal floor. I'm gonna do one like... Ooh, maybe I'm not gonna have room. Nope, I'll have room. Put one there. Okay, can I do it the whole way down? All right, we'll do it to there for now. And then we'll just wait until that's built and then I'll move it down on top of it. All right, got a plan. Energy crystals will turn the soil into sand and greatly decrease growth rate in that soil. Okay, so, oh, plant energy crystals in hydroponics. All right, I actually have them, like you were saying, sitting in soil right now, so it's, probably going to destroy that soil as you were as you were mentioning hydroponics have i researched that yet okay let's see here Hydroponic tracks. Let's slap them on right there. Okay. Was angered by Naraz. I, you know what? You should be nice to Naraz. Have we gotten some of these traps down? We have. Oh, I like that. We, okay, good. We do have those said to be butchered. I think we are gonna need to cut down more trees. Maybe we cut down some over here. Uh, let's see cut those and that one now well, we had some meat routed away that's not great but what are we gonna do it's my battery saying at about 80 percent okay We'll put it on, uh, put it on full speed and let them get to work on that. Hopefully we'll see some more, see some more work on this. I'd like to get their base up so that they are not all sleeping in this like little cramped little barracks. They don't really care for that. I know that. Oh, cool. Naras is tailoring stuff. That's awesome. Working on shirts, and then we got pants, sneakers, and straw hats. Maybe we should bump these up a little. Actually, I know we have some pants. We're about to go bad, so maybe we'll do pants first. Ember, what's 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 wrong? What's going on? Hungry. You know what? There is plenty of stuff. Sora has physical five. That's awesome. All right, Ember got some food. All's well. I think we could probably turn this off. Seventy-six outdoors. Yeah, extinguish that. This is very cool. They're getting that done. 
You know what, I wonder if I shouldn't wipe out some of these uh, in here that are planned to be constructed. Uh, let's see. Actually, what if, could I just draw that and then go, okay. Wall constructions, cancel. And then sticks wall. It won't let me remove those. I'll have to do that manually. Cancel. Cancel. And then these... construct those and deconstruct those and as well one more time deconstruct those all right that'll clear all of the uh it goes down one that seems like it's going to be problematic yeah, I, I, uh, I, I can do the conversion from Celsius to Fahrenheit kind of in my brain, but it takes me a little while to do it, and and I've done Fahrenheit for so long it's just easier, and, and I know it, Fahrenheit doesn't really make any sense. It's sort of a very bizarre uh, set of measurement, but it's kind of what I'm used to, so I haven't stuck at that. Can I put like, like a set of steps in here? I mean, will that work? Or is that even necessary? I wonder if I'm gonna be in trouble there. Oh, it's okay. No, no, I was talking about the difference between Celsius and Fahrenheit, just that uh, it's it's hard to switch from one to the other when you have, you know, lived most of your life doing one. And uh, it is, uh, especially when, like, you can certainly see the, like, I can see how logical Celsius is. It makes so much sense. 100 is boiling, zero is freezing. That is completely logical but it is still hard to wrap your brain around it when you know for all of your life you have had you know temperatures have been measured in fahrenheit it's it's difficult to to make that change so yeah the thing that i was concerned about is like this new area that I've built here is significantly lower. You can see it's like a little bit lower than this is here. I'm concerned that, you know, I'm not gonna be able to like move from like this area to this area. I mean, can I put like a set of steps in there or is that even necessary? we can do is since we don't have that we can just move it down here how are we doing on clothes here I feel like he has he has been putting some together so, <laughs> oh, excuse me. Maybe it's time to get some of my guys who um, really need new clothes to change into them. We could put him into a new shirt. 
that wouldn't be bad. His here is at about 50%. I don't know that we have any pants that are... Ooh, yeah, those are junk. So we'll wait on pants. What about her? She, well, I oh know that's a jacket. Really, she doesn't need a jacket right now. We could get her a new shirt. Naras, you kind of need a new hat. You can just put a baseball cap on for the time being. And I, I don't know, maybe your hat, maybe your shirt is okay. You need a new hat for sure. And a new shirt. Okay, let's let people change clothes. I think. Is she assembling laser pistols? She is. Oh, that's so good. You know, while they're doing that, I want to see if, uh, oh, crafting five, outstanding. That's real good. Do I have anybody that I could grab? Connor is playing darts from, from like three feet away. Oh, ads. Ah. Uh, that is definitely something that is a real drawback of making affiliate. I remember when I first made it, I was so excited about it and people were complaining about ads and I'm like, what are you talking about? And that's when I first learned what a real pain they can be. Well, I am gonna wrap up in not too long here. I have an, an early morning, sadly. Uh, tomorrow night at 6.30 p.m. Pacific and 9.30 on the East Coast, I'll be doing more of the Colony Sim going medieval, and then I'll be back with Stranded on uh, Saturday afternoon at 12 noon Pacific and 3 p.m. on the East Coast. But, uh, TSG, thank you so much for stopping by today. I appreciate that. If you, uh, if you hung out with me live, if you're watching the VOD, or if you're checking it out over on the YouTube channel, thank you. I appreciate that. If you have any ideas or any thoughts about the colony and you want to leave a comment, I will 100% read them, and I'm eager to hear it. That is it, though. You guys enjoy yourself. Take care of yourselves. I will see you next time. So long.